Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and hello again Pisces. Alrighty guys, these are quick reads we're doing on the occasion of a full moon in Aquarius. So, effects are obviously going to be around for some time, but we're still close to it. So I thought, let's pull up a message for each one of the signs. And so you guys happen to be the happy conclusion to that series. And I hope you are all doing great, great, great Pisces. Alrighty guys, so the 10 cards you know, and we are considering, you know what, growth, financial growth, professional growth in career, etc., etc. I begin with a situation where we're looking to find some exciting changes, okay, but also to stabilize in terms of finances. So we're trying to find, okay, a way to have fun, make some changes, but also stabilize the current financial situation. It's as if to say you're not looking to leave, okay? Uh, not necessarily looking to leave uh, based on the immediate, current immediate situation as well. I have the hangman here who's saying, I kind of like it here. I want to make it better, but there are changes that have to happen in order for me to have this inspired job satisfaction. There are also changes that need to be clear in terms of the money part of things. So I'm going to go straight to someone who is perhaps employed, seeking an upgrade, and the money part needs to be renegotiated or made right. Okay, And the workload and the work routine, or maybe even authorities, need to be set in place. As if to say, Pisces, you are seeing this situation from a 180 view point. And I like it a lot when you put yourself in the, not shoes here because there's no shoes, but when you put yourself in the viewpoint of those you're asking things from, okay? You're asking more money, okay? Let's put yourself in the um, owner or in the boss's shoes and see what do they need to do in order, you know what, to feel good about giving you what you're asking. So you're doing this, you know what, very, very meditative, very... Pisces like understanding of the other side, you know, and I love it and I love it. And when you do that, you are then fulfilled with the passion to really go for what you're asking for. Something tells me this is about a promotion. This is about an upgrade. Um, and at the same time, it's about following your passion. So we're beginning to say, okay, we want to be inspired, follow our passion and also stabilize that money part from that particular job. The money part is around you, Pisces. I can't escape it. Look at the coins we have here. So we're gonna talk about it. <laughs> and then putting the material priorities, okay? Knowing, because you spent this time, right? If you spent this time, then you know, it isn't just gonna be, I'm walking into Jim's door and I'm, you know, busting the door and saying, hey, Jim, you give me that raise now because, or well, because what? Understanding, because. I work so hard, I do so much good, um, and a little bit of merchandising too. Not without me, you would be lost, but in a way, this is my value add. You have the idea here that you can set priorities as an asset. Alrighty, for God's sake, let's take them and, and work with them now. What needs to be prioritized? It's the other side. The other side needs to have, you know what, your skill sets as a must-have. The other side needs to see that, yes, without this Pisces here who thinks that way, who acts that way, um, we could not progress good. So relaying the information, merchandising yourself, what needs to be known first about Pisces? What skill sets need to be highlighted first? What is the priority to highlight first? I love it. It has to do also with you being grounded. It has to do with you seeking that kind of mindset. You're in it for the long term in this um, space if it resonates. And that's how you get the opportunity. So the opportunity is coming as a king of coins. Guess what? That happens to those who stick around. Stability, as you stick around, leads to the upgrade, leads to the promotion. Sticking around, staying the course, leads to the promotion. The promotion is coming right here. Anyway, outlook on the situation, looking at this, Ten of coins. What do you want to say about the ten of coins? It's a work-life balance situation. 
It's stability in the finances. It's the inspiration to go to work, to have fun, to be the leader that you are. I love it, Pisces, okay? You're getting me excited and it's Sunday morning. Alrighty, in terms of timing, three. Get creative. It could be three months. Get creative or get there prior to having the number four. As if to say, you're working on finding that fourth leg. You're working on completing this, okay? But the best thing I have for you here is you're so inspired. You're so full of ambition. And you are causing the changes. That's what we're trying to do. We were causing changes here. Now we want to cause material changes. We want this money here to turn into tens. And guess what happens for a possibility? Sticking around, staying your course, not having jumped, having spent time, looked at things. You get your chariot, you get the promotion, you get the tools, you get the supports, you get the authority, you get a lot of gold, Pisces. And with that being said, guys, I'm going to close it off here. Um, thank you so much for those who watched. And I want you guys to know we do love you madly. And bye for now.